Hey, it's Mike with Five Star Marketing. Thank you so much to everybody that downloaded the app. We've had such a great response to it, but we've also had a lot of questions, so I thought I'd go through some of those questions, make it a little easier as you go through the app. The biggest question that we have is, where's the logout button? If you look closely, there is no logout button, but anytime that you hit your home screen or you back back out of the app and get out of it, it automatically logs you out, so there's no logout to touch. Each time you go back into the app, it'll make you authentic authenticate it so you can rest easy that once you get out of it, you're out of it and it's not running in the background. Another question people have had is where is the transfer? If you go to the menu at the top and click the menu, when you see the drop down, you'll see transfer and member transfer. If you hit transfer, that's how you would transfer between your own accounts. So if for instance you hit it, you have a checking account, you want to send some of that money to your savings account, here's where you would do it. Or vice versa, you have a savings wanting to go to a checking account, or if you have loans, things like that, and you want to make a payment, you would do the transfer button. Underneath that on the same menu is member transfer. That's where you would transfer from one of your accounts to an existing member's account. There you would figure out which account you'd want to go from, either a checking account or a savings account, and then you would put the first three letters of the member's name in, their member number, and then the where it's going, like a checking account, savings account, things like that. And, and that's how you would transfer between your account and a member's account. So remember that if you want to transfer money within your own accounts, you use transfer. If you want to transfer to an, a member, like you have lunch with someone, they pay, you need to pay them back, you would go through the member transfer. So remember, there's two separate ways to do that. A couple of other things to point out. On your dashboard, if you go all the way, scroll to the bottom of the app, you see Organize Dashboard. If you click on that, you can see what is on your dashboard. So the first thing that comes up, if you want to see your accounts, transactions, payments, manage cards, things like that, that's where you'll see that. On the manage cards part at the bottom, if you slide the slider to the left, it turns that card off. If you turn the slider to the right, it turns the card back on. That's an easy way to cut down on fraud. When you're using your card, have it on. When you're not gonna use your card, have it turned off. So if someone has stolen that card, they can't use it. And finally, something to keep an eye on is messages. That second down will send tips. Sometimes we'll send important information that is going on at Five Star Credit Union through the app, and that will be there in the messages. So if you'll check that on a regular basis and check to see if we have any messages, sometimes we may have answered your question for you. We really appreciate that you've downloaded the app, you've embraced it. If you have questions, you can send a message through the app, or you can also call our member care center at 888-619-1711, and that would be option seven. Keep using the app.